Do you ever wake up with high fasting blood sugar levels even when you barely ate the night before? Here's what's going on and what you can do about it. Whatever you ate or the time that you had dinner almost has nothing to do with your fasting blood sugar levels. Fasting blood sugar levels are not coming from the food that you ate last night. It's actually coming from your liver. So here's what's actually going on. Between the hours of 3 a.m. to 6 a.m., your brain sends a message to your adrenal glands that it's time to wake up, right? And this adrenal glands secrete certain hormones like cortisol and adrenaline. These hormones tell your liver to start pumping glucose into the bloodstream. This is completely normal. It happens to everybody. But when you have insulin resistance, two pretty bad things happen. Number one, this glucose surge isn't properly absorbed into the cells, so it lingers in the bloodstream for longer. And number two, your liver doesn't actually stop pumping glucose into the bloodstream because it doesn't know when to stop. This happens due to insulin resistance of the liver. That's the key problem right there, insulin resistance of the liver cells. And then I have thousands of people messaging me, what do I do to lower my fasting blood sugar values? Is it something that I need to eat the night before? Is it my dinner time? Uh, am I eating too many carbohydrates? Am I eating this and that? Not really. Until you fix insulin resistance of the liver, fasting blood sugar is going to be elevated. And now you may be asking, how do I fix insulin resistance of the liver? Well, it usually happens when your liver cells, known as hepatocytes, have accumulated a certain amount of lipid droplets, fat droplets, that are disrupting insulin signaling at a cellular level. This problem can be reversed through a series of lifestyle changes, proper supplementation, and staying consistent with those changes. It's not done through low carb diets or through altering the order of your foods or downing some apple cider vinegar before your meals. No, lifestyle changes is the only way. And there you have it, my friends. We have gathered lots of free guides that can help you reverse insulin resistance. So if you're interested in getting it, please make sure to first subscribe to our channel by hitting subscribe right here, then click on our name, and then go ahead and click on our links that you're gonna see in our channel. That way you will be able to download all of our free guides. Take care.